Today, we will be doing another experiment with sound. <laughs> we will be making drums with different items and explore how sound is made. So stay tuned to have some drumming fun with us and let's get started! For these amazing homemade drums, you will need containers of different sizes, we've got a bowl and an empty tin can, chopsticks, some cellophane paper, large balloons, rubber bands, a pair of scissors and some rice and marbles or pebbles. This is an easy, quick and super fun sound experiment for kids to learn about how sound is produced. So let's get started. Step 1. For the first drum, using the scissors, cut the end off the balloon. Then stretch the balloon over the empty tin can. And that's it! An instant drum! For the second drum, cut the cellophane paper to fit over the bowl. Then secure it with the rubber band. The different materials will each produce a different sound when you bang on the drums. And that's it! Two drums in two minutes! Step 2. Now add the rice and pebbles to the top of each drum. Step 3. Now start banging those drums and watch the rice and marbles fly all over the place. When banging on the ball with the rice, it produces a slightly pitchy sound, but it has a lot of bass. When banging on the empty tin can with the balloon and the pebbles, it produces a pitchier sound because the tin can is empty. So which drum causes the objects on top to bounce the highest? The bowl with the rice! <laughs> wow! That was so much fun! Lots of noise and a mess, but we had loads of fun! <laughs> we hope you enjoyed this video! Thank you for watching! Oh, and please remember to subscribe to our channel!